Alright guys, so we're back and we're taking shots tonight, which we already obviously did. I am introducing that because well we're at the bar in the house. So we've taken two shots, chocolate slash coffee, which is what it tastes like, and there's like this weird yellow fruit that's I say Nancy. Whatever. It's called Nancy. And I'm kind of feeling them because I did the test we were doing the test video and we were gonna do it again, but if I do it again, I'm gonna be drunk. Yeah, but there's, there's no re repeating this, so... We took them, they were really good. Yeah, they were really, really good. So... Okay. So start with, you pick. Pick a flavor? Yeah. Okay, well, how about the one that burns? No, let's, let's do the other one, the one that doesn't burn. I'll leave the one that burns for later. Okay, well, let's take the one that burns. I okay, they both burn. All right, so. Look, I was gonna count to three, but. It's usually how it goes. Oh my god. A coffee. Yes, but licorice. It's not licorice, it's liquor. Anyway. Licorice is disgusting. Liquor is not. Fun. Alright, let's try that one. So you want the fruit that doesn't burn. Okay, and I count one, two, three. I'm gonna grab a diaper for the baby over here. Oh my god. Ah, uh, so that was super strong. You want some more juice? No, I got some. Okay guys, now we've seen the shot and let's flash back to Copan. eran representativos, el amarillo era el sol, el azul el cielo y el rojo era sacrificio y vida. So the colors are representative, so the blue represents the sky, the yellow represents the sun, and the red represents sacrifices to the god. Este lugar es muy importante. He said that this area was very important. Y ha sido bastante útil para estudiar la vida social de los mayas. And it has been really, um, helpful to study the social life of my, the Maya Desde, Empire. Desde 1930, le llamaron el cementerio Maya. Since 19, one, um, 1930, it was called the Mayan Cemetery. El nombre de cementerio se lo dio esta famosa arquitecta rusa americana que se llamaba Tatiana Proskuryakov. Tatiana Proskuryakov was a famous American um, archaeologist who named this area. Es come through a secret door over there and then the wife was already here and then they will start poking his ears and whatever with the fish bones that I told you I can't remember and then that's when he communicated with the gods the building represents the three stages of uh, mythology my mythology Okay, just kidding. This represents the uh, fertility and the heavens. Um, I forgot the word. Space. Um, and so this right here below, you see how the skulls and stuff is like ugly? That's, mm -hmm. that's hell. And over there is like space and heaven. 
Pero esto es algo muy importante porque le decía referente, representa hace unos investigadores fertilidad y cosmología. Si usted se fija, están los cargadores del tiempo, ¿no? los backups o palvatures que son estos personajes. En los uh, statues are called bacats. Palguatunes, and they were like the, the guardians of uh, time. So my friend Kevin thinks he's drunk <laughs> with like two drinks. Not even a drink. Nick had like There's three margaritas and he's not even there. I'm here. But yeah, this is our last night in Copan. <laughs> Till next time. This is the town square. And that was the bar that we were just hot. It's called Twisted. It's owned by a British uh, lady. So you can see the town, it's so calm and beautiful. There's no crime, people like to um, exaggerate things. What do you have to say about the crime? Um, zero. Nada? Nada, do you yeah, nada. Do you recommend coming here? Always. Always? Will you come back? More than once. More than once? And those are the lovebirds in front of me. <clears throat> One of my longtime best friends. And it's not here. quite a knot, but it's being tied. <laughs> it's what? It's not quite the knot, but it's being tied. I don't know what that means. I guess I'll have to Google it later. Yeah, Google it. Bilingual problems. Yeah. For me. See, Honduras is not dangerous, people, so don't listen to the fake news. They're real fake news. Anyway, we're just thanking you for joining us and hoping you join us again because there's more to see and more to hear. Uh, lots of travel. Lots to eat, lots to see, lots to hear. So just vegan keep eating. eating. Cause Nick yeah, is vegan. Man. I don't use the V word. This is a thing. That's what's so. called better time because. Oh yeah, T H Y, like the herb. Groundbreaking, right? Well, that's what we chose. So that's what you're getting. All right, oh so yeah. So um, cheers. So if you guys like our video, please like and subscribe um, for more content. It's gonna be somewhere around the bottom or up, however I decide to edit it. Um, there's gonna be more videos coming up. We have some more footage from Honduras, um, and we hope to be traveling this following this coming year. Um, and if you have suggestions or comments, just let us know, and we'll be happy to read them and put them up for practice. Thank you.